When you click People on the Administration toolbar, it takes you to the People area of your Drupal site. You'll notice the tabs List, Permissions, and Roles. Once again, this is just an introduction. We'll cover this in much more detail. But what this section does is it allows you to create user accounts, manage permissions about what people can see, and what people can do on your site. You'll notice that the username admin is here, and if I click Edit, I can see all of the things about my own user account. I can change my password, but I need to know my current one. I can also reset it if I don't know. And I'm an administrator, I'm active, and I have my own contact form, and I have my location settings. If I want to update this and add my own picture, I certainly can if you want to go ahead. But this is where you manage your own profile. Click Save. And as we add roles, and then give those roles permissions. We'll assign users to those roles. They'll get certain permissions and thereby be allowed to do certain things and see certain things on your Drupal site. People is where we manage all of the users on our Drupal website.